So again, it's Priscilla Batzel and Spring Hill, Florida at Expressionist Art Studio Gallery with a 10 by 20 inch canvas that was black to begin with and a will to do a swipe. <laughs> One don't I? I love swipes. I cannot get enough swipes. I, I dream about swipes. I, I think about swipes first thing in the morning. Anyway, I've been thinking about swipes and dots, but I'm not sure if this is going to be that yet. This is my OXO omelette turning flip and fold spatula. It's available on the Amazon link. The Amazon link is a great place to shop that helps me out at no added cost to you. And it's on the link tree, which is the first blue link under the video. And it has all my other links on it, including my Facebook groups and my, my web page, pages, and Pinterest, Instagram, Twitter links. It also has PayPal and Patreon, should you happen to want to be included into the monthly drawing. You can see the prizes for the monthly drawing on the end screen video. The exhibition video changes every month. So I think I'm just going to use both black and white and put a puddle right down the middle and some colors into that puddle. see what happens. I'm going to use my purple flash as long as it's open and coming out, and which is not very well. That needs to be cleaned out. And the hot orchid from Color Art. And the other colors that I was thinking about using today to make something that reminded me of something I was nostalgic for. I'm a little nervous about some of them. I might want a little bit of magenta. I might want some of this red-orange from Folk Art and it's color shifting. I always like to have some gold. It's a Deco Art Americana, 24 karat gold. Kind of feel like that might be enough. Although I could put some electric blue in there. So if I take my Amsterdam black with pre-stained wood conditioner in it and a card, I'm going to use the rounded end this time. I'm going to dip this in. And scrape it off and wipe it off. And my studio rag is not as wet as it usually is, so I'll flip it over. Grab some more. I'm very tempted to tilt this. But I might not, because I like the design I've got so far. It might be super simple. Reminds me of like six other things I've done recently, but not in these colors. I don't want to waste those colors. Not sure what I'm going to do about that. Part of me wants to tip. No, don't do it. So I'm going to take a Princeton Art Tool Catalyst spatula and that beautiful, beautiful paint that I see there and just add it right to what I've got. Right over the edge. Call this super quick. Take a skewer with a paintball on the end, maybe. Not much of one. Add 
add a couple of little flourishes. Hope I don't overstep my boundaries. No, I'm loving this. The colors are great. I could use a little bit more of something there. Maybe I can blow that out with a straw very carefully. Just a gentle touch. No, that's too cool. The cells are tremendous over here. But I've got these puddles of paint. And a strong desire not to waste them. And I kind of think I can get away with adding something right there. Not that it's going to add anything to anything, because I was really at Nirvana for a second there. But I guess I like to play too much. Oh wow, I just dragged the tip, the, um, the cap from my bottle through my painting. Oh well, don't tell. We'll just make it into something else. I've got beautiful paint in my dish and a strong desire not to waste it. And I love orchids and I'm getting a flower vibe from this, at least partially. This is not usually the way I use up my leftover paint. Really don't want to go too far, I'm nervous. I think it's gonna be okay. I hope so. That might have been one too many. I really did not want to ruin this. I love this. I love you guys too. Take care of each other. Take care of yourselves. Check out some of my 1900 videos. 19 playlists with 100 each. That's helping. Bring the eye over here. Jump there, there, there. Have I got any gold in my little dish? I'm gonna I'm gonna risk a few dots. <laughs> and it's definitely feeling risky. That's something. very dark paint that's coming out of this little dish. I'm going to have to pick more carefully. So what can I tell you guys? The Teespring clothing below the video is mine and it's got Oliver print leggings and Oliver print t-shirts. If you don't mind or you're looking for some really beautiful dresses and high-end fashion, check out my Legalaris new venue. It's on the link tree. The link tree is the first blue link under the video. I think I can make that little white line that doesn't belong there disappear. I'm a little bit interested in blowing into this area here. Yep, yeah, that sort of mirrors that. What else can I do? This is bizarre. I like it. I like bizarre. I don't think these dots will even hardly show, or they won't show much anyway.
So that's it. <laughs> I'm done. I can't force myself to put any more stuff in there because I love the colors and I will be doing that combination again for sure. Thank you guys for all the wonderful comments that keep my morale boosted. Thank you for all the donations that help keep me painting all this time. Make sure you know that on my YouTube channel banner on the bottom right hand corner you can find PayPal and Patreon icons and if you are somebody who contributes to help the, keep the studio rolling you'll be automatically entered in the monthly drawing. On the exhibition video on the end screen of every video in the last 20 seconds you can see the prizes at the beginning. If, you, if you're interested in helping out that would be great and if you're if you can't be somebody who donates, you help me out by giving me a thumbs up. Your comments are helpful. Watching the videos long, longer is the most helpful of all. When you share, it's a big assistance. I really appreciate it. I want to make sure that you guys know that on my link tree is Pinterest, Instagram, Twitter links. My Facebook groups are Expressionist Art Studio Gallery Appreciation Group for Students. And you can see tomorrow's video. On my YouTube channel banner, you can also find the community board with tomorrow's videos and, and videos that have been recently posted. You can scroll back through. Um, I told you about the Teespring. I told you about the Legalerist. Legalerist is the link. If I didn't say that, I should. My Amazon link has my two books, Because I Can, and Unlimited Possibilities, Volumes 1 and 2, and lots of great tools. If you have questions, please ask me. If you are looking for my paint pouring recipe, it is included below Show More underneath the video. And when you open Show More, you'll find my email address. Should you be interested in purchasing an artwork, use my email address and the hashtag and the file number in the title of the video you're interested in, or let me know which, which exhibition video you saw and uh, what time you saw what you were interested in, and I will do my best to help you out. If you have questions, like I said, ask me, I'll get back to you. If I don't know the answer, I'll let you know that too. I love you guys. Take care of each other. Take care of yourselves. I post seven days a week, and Friday, Saturday, and Sunday night at 10 p.m. also. Not sure about the daytime hours. They change, but uh, the nighttime hours stay the same. I love you guys. I know I said that. Bye for now. Take care of each other. I know I said that too. I'll see you anon. Bye. Priscilla out.